Lexus earned its luxury reputation by building sensory deprivation tanks on wheels. Soft, quiet, and comfortable could describe both the driving dynamic and design approach. I'm Tom Volk with Driven for the New York Times. A quick look at this, this, and this shows the brand is trying to ditch that reputation with the third generation IS350. Years ago, if you wanted a true sports sedan, you'd simply go down to your BMW store and pick up a 3 Series. Nowadays, Audi, Cadillac, Infiniti, Mercedes, they all make great product. And now, Lexus wants to join the party. This is not a Corsage. F-Sport adds adaptive variable suspension. Dial in the firmness or softness that you want. This one's all-wheel drive, so the variable gear ratio steering found on rear drive models is not included. This is a joy to hold. Deeply bolstered chairs hug like mom. The IS is an athletic car with no body roll when the suspension is firmed up. The chassis structure is bank vault solid, steering is crisp, so are the gear changes. In short, the IS is a blast to drive, easily the equal of ATS or 3 Series. You'd have to have all three out on a racetrack back to back to tell which one you like best. F-Sport gets no bump in power. The 3.5 liter V6 makes 306 horsepower and a lovely growl. How on Lexus-like. Rear drive models get an eight-speed gearbox, all-wheel drive settles for six. In a drag race, IS 350's zero to 60 time of five and a half seconds means a loss to BMW 335i and Audi S4. EPA fuel economy numbers are 19 city, 26 highway using specified premium fuel. Pushing it hard, I averaged 19, uh, the cost of having a good time. Inspired by the LFA supercar, the fighter jet cockpit wows everyone that nestles into it. A great show, the adjustable digital speedometer and tack can be a little hard to read during hard maneuvers. The Mark Levinson audio system is so good, it manages to make satellite radio sound tolerable. The mouse-like user interface is frustrating and distracting while driving. This bulge may bother some drivers. Check that out on your test drive. According to the people who keep track of these things, I am pretty much an average sized guy at five foot nine. I have just enough room to get comfortable here. There are belts for three, uh, keep it to two due to the large drive shaft tunnel. Couples should be good back here, but they can't store stuff here or charge up a phone. You have to love standardized testing. It's so revealing. 3 Series easily gobbles up five packs of the two-ply, ATS holds four. IS stops at five bundles, even if you could squeeze in six, the huge hinge arms would crush fragile stuff. At least there's this, not all sports sedans offer the convenience. The bold grille is sensuous, but all of this is pretty fussy. To my eye, Lexus could have stayed conservative with the stretched taillights as well. They look out of place on a $50,000 sports sedan. And yes, that's what this particular car will set you back. IS250 starts at around 37 grand. Do yourself a favor and fork over the additional 3,500 bucks for the 350 and its extra 102 horsepower. The 2014 IS350 sharpens the Lexus experience. Add another tough competitor to the heap of great sports sedans.